This is an excerpt of a recent power-up webinar on creating clip speed changes in Adobe Premiere Pro. Hi, my name is Larry Jordan. Changing the playback speed of a clip is a fast and easy way to create an eye-catching visual effect. In this short video, I'll show you how to use the Rate Stretch tool to create clip speed effects on demand. We have slow motion, but we also have fast motion. This is a gondola ride down one of the mountains in uh, New Zealand, South Island. And while it's lovely, it's taking too long. I'd like to go fast, faster, fast. It's all about speed. Command R, and this time rather than making a number less than 100, which means slower, I'm going to make it greater than 100, which means faster. And now when I play it, we are whipping through. Let's set this to fit to fill. There we go. We are whipping downhill much more quickly. Except, what happens if I don't want to work with a specific number? I want to, I want to go with the feel, and I can't figure out what the numbers are. Well, there's a tool in Premiere. If we go down three tools and click this small triangle right here, this third tool down called the Rate Stretch tool makes that a whole lot easier. What the Rate Stretch tool does it allows me to grab the edge of a clip and drag it. And as I drag it, I change the speed. So let's go here. And now we're at 75% slow motion. Or grab it here. Now, uh, not so far, so I can see the percentage. Here I'm at 200%. Or here I'm even more. Ooh, we're not on a gondola, we're falling. So using the Rate Stretch tool, I can adjust the speed of a clip, not by typing in the number, but by dragging the edge of the clip so it has the duration or the feeling that I want as I look at it, rather than having to worry about, well, is it 66% or 43 or 21 and a half? You'll get the smoothest slow motion by picking a number which divides evenly into 100. So 50, 40 is close enough, 20, 25, 12 and a half, 10. Any number that divides evenly into 100 will give relatively stutter-free slow motion playback. Remember, that's the third tool down. Click the small triangle and select the right stretch tool. This was an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar on creating clip speed changes in Adobe Premiere Pro. For the complete version of this online training, please visit my store at larryjordan.com slash store and look for Webinar 349. By the way, when you need to stretch your training dollars, membership in our video training library saves you money and time. You can access all our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's almost 2,000 movies, hundreds of hours on a wide variety of subjects. Plus, premium members can download practice media and projects. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it multiple times each month. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.com slash membership. And thanks.